Hi, my name is Mao Lun, and I'm from University of Texas at Austin. And uh, my, the title of my poster is a phylogenetic analysis of pelagonium based on plastic markers and f providing a framework for comparative genomic research. The, uh, there are three co-authors in this poster, and one is my advisor, Rob Jensen, Robert Jensen, and the other one is from uh, Botanical Garden and Edinburgh. It's uh, Marine Gibby. So basically, my first part of my research is try to construct a phylogeny of this genus. I use five plastic markers to construct a phylogeny, and uh, what I got is a very good phylogeny of this genus and uh, well support for the major clades. However, there is one clade called A1. This is uh, unresolved in my data. Uh, so I compare previous study from Baker et al. 2004 and my result to do a uh, topology test. Um, however, the result still leaves these two, uh, two species, Pelagonia ovale and Pelagonia nanum, the position of their phylogenetic relation relationship still unresolved. So maybe I need to uh, further sample some taxa of this related uh, species. And the other interesting thing about my poster is that among the five uh, markers I used, the RPOC one has extremely long branches compared to other markers. Um, and because there is an intron in RPOC one, so I try to compare the exon and the intron, the, there's, the result shows very unexpected uh, topology of these two trees, that, that is exon actually has more variation than intron in this gene. So this is quite unique to, to our, our background. So, uh, I, so I will further to investiga investigate the other gene which ha has intron in it to compare the rate and uh, compare the, 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 the other gene with other related species. So that is basically what I get so far. Okay, and uh, thank you very much.